All right, Jason. Now to a local 4 News update. Detroit police tonight impounding the Dodge Charger from this video doing donuts on Jefferson in front of two police vehicles. The viral video posted on Instagram shows a 17 year old driver doing dangerous stunts with young passengers inside. Police say the vehicle was found in Gross Point. The officers on the scene have not been identified, but a warrant is expected to be submitted to the prosecutor this week. Three staff members are now facing charges in the death of a teenager who died while being restrained at a youth center in Kalamazoo. Cornelius Fredericks was living at Lakeside for Children Foster Care Facility, where he was allegedly restrained by staff for 10 minutes while saying he could not breathe. The three staff members are being charged with involuntary manslaughter. On Detroit's east side, an apartment building goes up in flames. The building at the corner of East Grand Boulevard and Agnes has been under renovation, with only 15 of the 75 units currently occupied. We're told a fire started in an unoccupied unit. The cause is unclear. No injuries have been reported. An investigation is underway tonight after a noose is found at Gross Point South High School. The building has been under construction while the school's been closed. And for the last month, the only people inside, we're told, have been the Turner Construction Group. They found the noose while conducting a safety walkthrough last night and immediately blocked off that room. While no GPPSS staff or students were thought to be involved in this incident, the district is participating fully in the investigation as we are committed to ensuring all people feel safe in our schools. Hate and intolerance have no place in our society or in our district. Construction company says it is cooperating with the investigation, which will likely utilize the school's 200 camera security system, which has been up and running, by the way, during the closure.